Hey beauties, my name is Chanel and today I'll be Chanelling you guys up on how I give layers to my hair. So this is a human wig and I'll give you guys all the gist and details about this amazing hair in a little bit but I want to let you guys know that I am not a professional so just in case if you are a professional you are more savvy with the scissors than I am just to let you know I am not a professional I am sharing my tips and tricks which you guys requested but for my professionals go ahead and comment down below adding all the other tips and tricks that others can possibly do you know to perfect on how to just handle the scissors on their own if you may so if you would like to know how to you know handle the scissors and get some angles to your hair so that it can hug your face and not hover your face then just continue on watching also be sure to hit the bell right next to the subscription button so you don't miss out on any videos like these all right beauty so jumping straight into it these are the different type of scissors that i usually use when framing my hair for my face structure i'll have them linked down below in the description bar uh, but for now we're gonna go ahead and section off our hair so we're doing ear to ear section and then our back section so three sections in total and you guys this amazing hair is by eva wigs you guys all the details about this wig will be listed down below in the description bar i'm gonna grab on my regular shear and the technique that i use is i cut right below from my chin uh, for that you know soft layer look and then um, i cut diagonally and here i'm showing you slowly but surely as i go down in that diagonal way i'm cutting slowly and surely and now what I'm gonna do is grab some from my back section and make sure that just goes in a nice diagonal cut if that make any sense so I don't, I don't have any blunt cuts anywhere everything looks really nice and transitioned so now I am doing this on the other side and just to let you guys know it's always best you guys to do this whole method while your hair is wet Moving forward, I am grabbing a section on the side of my hair and I'm bringing it to the other side and I'm just going to cut off like one inch of that. And this is going to give me more definition towards the side as you guys can see. So therefore it's not like all straight. So I'm going to also do this on the other side and as well as the back area. I don't like to cut so much from the back because the more you do this, the more puffy and big it will look like. Um, so I just cut out just a little bit and it gives me just enough definition in the back as I need. All right, you guys, so this is exactly how I decided to go ahead and leave her. Now, um, the major tips I wanna give to you guys is with straight hair, you wanna make sure that you are taking your time. With curly hair, if a mistake happened while doing this process, it's not really visible unless you just really cut like a whole big section chunk. But as far as like if you're doing like angles and slowly but surely, and you do like a little light mistake, you're not gonna really see it with curly hair. But with straight hair, especially with sleek, bone straight, hair you will definitely see the mistakes so please you guys i'd rather you cut less and then cut out more later on as you need it than to cut more and then you know it'd be a huge mistake if you just don't trust yourself with some scissors then go ahead and seek professional services so yeah so yeah you guys that's all i have to say about that as for this amazing gorgeous hair y'all it's super summertime fine i'm loving how this hair looks this hair is so beautiful like y'all it's making me fall in love with curly hair all over again so if you would like to go ahead and pick up your very own Eva wigs the link will be down below in the description bar so you guys can definitely go ahead and purchase your very own so it is springtime and nearly summertime so i'm pretty sure they might have a little uh sale going on possibly i'll have the links down below in the description bar again you guys anyways thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like comment and definitely subscribe if you haven't done so already and as always till next time